this is the final part of my sunset dress video series before i put everything on and show you the final look all together i'm just going to show you quickly how i styled this wig to go with the dress um, it was just a quick time lapse so what i did was i put it into my curlers then i set it with steam then I took the curlers out once it had cooled down completely and the curls were completely set and then literally I just sort of brushed it and brushed it and held it with my hand until it went into the shape that I wanted it to. As I took the curlers out, I back combed the bottom part just to give it a little bit more volume at the bottom. And then I just brushed it into the shape I wanted, doing one row at a time. Um, I didn't do any more back combing on the top. I wanted to keep it as smooth and as sleek as possible because I've got to put the headpiece on top of it. And then, yeah, just gradually brushed and held and brushed and held. And then when I was happy with the shape, I put the clips in and gave it a really good spray with some mega hold hairspray. So here is the finished wig. I'm about to go and do my makeup and then I will put everything on and I will be back to show you the finished look with everything together.
final finished look of the sunset in France dress. I hope you've really enjoyed watching me create this right from my design concept through my testing of the fabrics, making the patterns and then seeing the finished look all come together. I love designing making dresses but I really love doing this complete look as well. Designing the hair, the makeup, the accessories and headpieces. It's exactly what I would do if I was showing this dress on a catwalk or if I was going to be doing a photo shoot with this dress, which I hopefully will once the weather is a little bit warmer and a little bit nicer. Um, I hope I got some okay footage. It's so hard shooting a dress like this in the space that I've got and doing it by myself as well. So hopefully it's all okay. <laughs> Overall, I'm really happy with it. There's a couple of things. I'm still not happy with the hoop. I'm going to change that at some point, I think, before I do a photo shoot with it. Um, the other thing I'm not happy with is when I airbrushed it, I pressed all the seams but they've all come open a little bit and you can especially on the corset where it's tight and you can just see white everywhere so that is something that I need to work on and see how I can overcome that if I do another airbrush dress but overall I am super super happy with it and I can't wait to get it out of the studio and shoot it somewhere in daylight and sunshine or at sunset that would be even better really happy with my wig this time as well. This one little curl's not playing ball, but overall I'm really happy with the wig. The headpiece, um, someone asked in the video where I made my headpiece if it was heavy. Um, I can't even feel it. With the wig underneath it, I think it's probably helping, but I can't even feel it at all. This is how it should have looked with my little dangle on, but it kept falling off, so I've given up on it. But I'll have to get some better spirit gun for next time. It's a shame, because I think it just finishes it really nicely, but... Yeah, it's just coming off really easily, so next time, better glue. I love how high this necklace is. It really makes you keep your chin up and sit really nicely, so yeah. Uh, I think I'll definitely wear bits of this just with other outfits, especially because this is black. I could wear the choker and the cuffs with other outfits. I'm definitely going to wear the wig again somewhere as well when we're all allowed to go out and have fun again. But for now, this is the end of my Sunset in France dress. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know what videos you like seeing on my channel, what sort of content you like seeing. Let me know what you'd like to see more of. I'm hoping to shoot the two videos about my collections that I was talking about in my Q&A videos soon. Um, and then I'm going to put up a whole video just from, just like a synopsis of start to finish of making this dress as well. So it's been a long time, 100 hours nearly. Well, probably 100 hours, which take into account all the... Um, the accessories hours and hours of editing as well it's been a long process but i think it was worth it so thanks for watching hope you enjoyed this see you soon